I am Dr. Regina Joseph. I am a physician and uh, I have done my graduation from St. John's Medical College and post graduation from uh, Bangalore Medical College. I have been practicing as a general physician for the last three decades. Now I have been practicing as an aesthetician in Splendore Cosmetic Clinic, Bangalore. PCOD is nothing but polycystic ovarian disorder or syndrome which is most commonly seen in 35% of the women in a newer trend. It's mainly because of the sedentary lifestyle which we have adapted in the women in the recent year. So the PCOD as we know 35% of normal population of the women do suffer from PCOD. It's nothing but you know there is lot of hormonal imbalance which causes excessive weight gain. There will be lot of ischism to the patient. They will have menstrual irregulation and also sometimes they have anovulatory cycle which causes infertility or they find difficulty to conceive or to have a pregnancy. So in these factors which are causing the PCOD if it is dealt at different different level. For obesity we can handle the patient checking the serum insulin level and glucose GRBS level with a diet control, nutrition balance and sometimes metformin is also found to be helping in the controlling the glucose level that comes when it comes to the obesity. When it comes to ischuism because of the hormonal imbalance, ischuism we can deal in cosmetic gynecology by using the diode probe which helps in unwanted hair removal in the cosmetic uh, field. And also when it comes to the ovulation induction, we have several drugs available in the market which helps in you know inducing the ovulation and thus the pregnancy could occur. And in newer trend what we have in the PCOD management here is when they have a thin endometrium of the uterus which is you know desired endometrium is required for implantation of the zygote for the pregnancy to continue further. In such event when there is a thin endometrium we have PRP that is nothing but the plasma taken from the patient which is centrifuge and this centrifuge plasma is infused into the uterine cavity is supposed to increase in the endometrial thickness which is found in couple of patients and found to be having a very favorable endometrium for zygote implantation and conceiving chances are found to be very high in this kind of patients and also for obesity we can always use if there is an any resistant in the focal fat deposit on the abdomen or on the double chin or on the thigh or inner aspect or lateral aspect which helps in you know fat reduction and overall in improving the personality of the person. Weight reduction and increase in fertility will help the patient to overcome PCOD.